Hey everyone and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video I will show you how to transfer from Trust Wallet to Bitmart. So without further ado, let's get right into it. The first thing you will want to do is to go over to your phone and open up the Trust Wallet app. Then you need to go over to Wallet in the bottom left. You will then see a screen looking similar to this one and over on this page you need to click on send. You will then see this pop up and here you will see all the coins you have available to transfer. For me the only coin I have available is Algorand, so once you have decided which coin you want to transfer, you can go ahead and click on it. You'll then be sent over to this page, and here the first thing you need to fill in is the address you want to transfer to. So to find this address, you need to go over to Bitmart. And once you're on Bitmart, the first thing you'll need to do is to go over to the top right and go over to your email. Then you need to click on deposit. You'll then be sent over to a page looking similar to this one. And over on this page, you need to go over to the search bar and search for the coin you want to transfer. So for me, that's Algorand. Now you will see your coin right here. And then you need to go over to Actions and click on Deposit. Now you will see your address and this QR code. So what you want to do now is to go over to your phone and click on the icon to the right of Paste. Now you need to make sure that your QR code is visible on your computer screen. And then you need to scan it with your phone. Once you've done that, your address will be imported. So what you need to do now is to fill in the amount of coins you would like to transfer. You can fill in this amount manually, or you can click on Max to transfer all of the available holdings. So once you have filled in the address and the amount of coins you would like to transfer, you can now click on Next. You'll then see this screen, and please make sure to double check all the information to make sure you haven't made any unnecessary mistakes, and then click on Send. If you found this video helpful, let me know by leaving a like or subscribing to my channel for more tutorials about cryptocurrencies.